welcome to my channel welcome I'm back if you're an og subscriber welcome if you are tuned in for the first time i hope you go ahead and like comment and subscribe girl why not so what's up y'all i was supposed to do like my intro before i even got in the car but baby i've been on the road okay it's 10 22 and i have been driving i feel like forever but i have a bunch of errands to run today it's monday and my mama was like well if you got errands to run i'll watch the baby okay girl don't you ain't gotta tell me twice all right love you baby girl be out of here <laughs> i was like you know what let me go ahead and run my errands because i was gonna run all of them tomorrow um after my doctor's appointment but i was like you know what instead of because i was i had to do the most um and so i was like you know what? i'm gonna split it up since i have to come out this way two days in a row what's one more day and honestly when we go to the doctor i'm not gonna say it's becoming an inconvenience but it is like low-key becoming an inconvenience because it's not down the street anymore and it just takes a little longer but i'm i'm making it work like i wanted to go get my feet done today and run all my errands but i was like nah i'll just get my feet done after my appointment tomorrow that way if all my errands you know are out the way i can just go to my appointment get my feet done and go home even though i'm like right here by the nail salon but yeah the area we in now they charge 15 dollars for jail bitch first of all $15 for jail? Are you kidding me? Like, and this everywhere. I've tried three salons now since we moved and I'm just not feeling it. Cause first of all, it's not even worth all that. <laughs> it's, it's not worth it. Like I can see if the pedicures was just lit, then yeah, but the fuck, no, I'm not paying that. And it's like the distance I drive, it's like you spending the 15 in gas, but I, at least my feet will be done good, you know? so um and don't get me wrong i did like the way the second when i got got them done a second time i like the way the lady did my massage that probably was the best massage i had in a while but i hated the way she did my toe shape like i do not like for my i don't be playing by my toe shape and i did not like the way she shaped my toes so yeah but i am I don't know what I'm gonna go first. I think maybe the beauty supply store. My boyfriend said he was gonna go to the beauty supply store for me and tell him everything I need. And I'm like, oh, that's so sweet, but no. <laughs> no, thank you. Um, it's not that simple. I be needing hella stuff from the beauty supply store. So, um, nah, I'm gonna just go myself. So I'm gonna go to the beauty supply store, then get gas. Since the um, gas station is right by I have to go to Beauty Masters, which I hate. I hate I can't just go to Beauty Exchange. I love Beauty Exchange. But Beauty Exchange, I don't think they sell LA Girl Pro no more. And that's a problem. Like, every time I go in there, they don't have that big section of LA Girl Pro products no more. And it's so odd. So, Yeah. I'm just gonna go to Beauty Exchange because I mean uh, Beauty Exchange, Beauty Masters because at least in there they do be having everything I need. But I like Beauty Exchange because they do the rewards points, so I like to get my rewards points. Okay, I be in mama mode, y'all. Like I be filling out surveys and reward points. Okay, anything to save a dollar, honey. Let's do it. But yeah, so I'm, I gotta go to the beauty store, get gas. I think I'm gonna go ahead and go down to Fayetteville, even though, like I said, I will be out that way tomorrow. It just, oh, you B I T C H. I hate when people do that. But yeah, even though I'm gonna be going out that way tomorrow, at least I'll just be passing through and won't necessarily have to stop. So I'm going to just go ahead and I think go down there and go to, ooh, ooh, oh my goodness, and go run the errands I need to run. I need to go to Michael's 
Aldi's, Walmart's, and a dollar store. So, yeah, it only makes sense for me to do all that today instead of waiting until tomorrow. Yeah. <clears throat> I also want to film a makeup look today. I probably won't get to it because I also have to do a client's graphics today. One of my clients ordered two flyers for me. I haven't been advertising that I'm doing the graphics again, but I always get inquiries and people are always asking me. So if you inquire, child, 10 times out of 10, I'm doing it. Um, I've just been working on stuff and I haven't really been getting nowhere. So I'm just working with what I got. I really don't know what type of computer I should be getting. So it's just been a lot because I don't want to be in a situation where I'm stuck with a brand new computer and then months later, oh, it's a dead dog. And then months later, I can't take it back because the time has worn out. So, yeah. What's up, y'all? So, it is almost 11.30. Your girl has been on a roll, okay? I've been on the phone with my man for the last hour. So, that's why I haven't been vlogging anything. I did vlog a little bit just now, but nothing for real, for real. I just left the international market. And if you know, you know, okay? My south side folks, if you know, you know. Well, they might actually have these markets other places too i would imagine they have them on the north side because the north side has a lot of like foreigners and everything like that so i would imagine that they got them over there too but i'm not sure but y'all i'm just so lit because i only spent 20 dollars and everything i thought i was getting i thought i would at least spend like 50 but i didn't I only spent 20 so i'm just so happy about that i went to the supply store so now I am about, oh you heifer, I am about to go to Fayetteville to finish running my errands. So like I said earlier, I think I gotta go to Walmart, the Dollar Store, Aldi, Michaels. I gotta pick up a picture case that I, I ordered from Michaels. So, I've been promoting it before, but if you guys want free photos, be sure to use my code. I'm going to have it below in the description box. But if you're like me and you love photos, you love looking at memories, things of that nature, it's an app called Get Photos. All you have to do is download it and you literally get like 85 free pictures a month. Yes, 85 free pictures a month, y'all. And all you have to do is pay for shipping. I can't remember how much shipping is. I didn't do, I skipped last month. Honestly, I just forgot. And so I can't remember how much, but it's like standard shipping. You just pay for shipping and you get free photos. They're all four by six. So if you do want like five by 10 or bigger pictures, it is a small fee. It's not like, I know it's not a dollar, but you gotta think about it as up if you're getting 85 photos. But sometimes I do get some of my pictures bigger and I just pay the difference, but it's never like a whole lot, like I said. So I gotta pick that up because it's normally $50. I do not understand why this case, I have to see it. Like when I pick up, when I pick it up, I'm really curious to know. Wow, that's just crazy. I'm really curious to know as to why this case is normally $50, but I got the, y'all don't mind my wig, okay? I didn't say that, but don't mind my wig, honey. It look a mess, I know. I have not had a brush. Y'all just don't understand. I've been wearing this wig for like a week and a half now, and I, I don't have a brush. I can't find a brush anywhere. I've literally just been using a wig brush, but I don't have a hard brush. So I literally just bought one from the beauty supply store. So yeah, don't, don't mind me. Yeah. I don't know why, like I said, I don't know why this case was $50, but we about to see because they had it, only got it because they had it on sale for $16.99 and normally it's $49.99. So, yeah. 
so I finally got that because I just been keeping my pictures in Ziploc bags Ziploc bags or like you know when you print photos and they come in like the little paper little envelope thing like with a little flap I keep them in that and Ziploc bags so yeah child real real ghetto here so I needed something to actually put them in so yeah Michael's beauty supplies. I already went to beauty supply store. Went to international markets. Got gas. I'm gonna go to Walmart, Aldi, Dollar Store. And I think that's it, child. I think that's it. Okay, y'all, I'm in Dollar Tree. And they have these, which I like the size of, but they don't have the car about $5. Come on, I'm paying $5 for this. This is cute and glittery, and they supposedly light up, but I made a mistake and pulled one, and it didn't so light up, but that's fine. Um, but I really want one that's like this size, but hard out. Then they have like this. Um, oh, these are cute. This would have been nice if I could find an orange one. I'm trying to find something for baby girls Halloween pictures. Um... I'm taking her like some cute little Halloween pictures. I ordered her an uh, outfit. Yeah, see they have a bunch of these, but I don't like these. But I ordered her an outfit and um, um sorry y'all, I'm getting distracted. An outfit and like two different pajama sets just because I'm extra. Even this is cute if it was bigger. I'm gonna still see if Michaels has something. I'm wondering if I should get like something like this for the door though. This would be cute. <laughs> I know my boyfriend would be like, what the hell? This cutesy stuff. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna try to vlog as much in here, but I need my phone to look at my list. This is not on my list. Let me keep going. I'm trying to see because I even could like decorate could decorate a pumpkin I started to get a real pumpkin in the farmer's market but I was like nah nah really not oh I'm passing by what I need I need just soap five olives I'm gonna get this palm olive <laughs> I'm gonna just get this one. Oh, I think we need more trash bags too I think so. I'm gonna just go ahead and get some. Just in case. We need cups. Baby, I should've got a buggy. This is ridiculous. I got a buggy two seconds ago. And it's how full it is. So, they pretty much had almost everything I needed except mama wanted some coffee creamer and we need some more little toilet bowl things so i'm probably gonna have to not probably i'm gonna have to go to family dollar after this i had to get up out of michael's child because i was about to be in there just buying all kind of shit but i got what i paid for so, let's go i was saying i was gonna get caught up i saw a whole well, not a whole, it was honestly just two other pumpkins that I really liked. Then I saw pumpkins I could paint, and I was like, girl, you don't have time for that. <laughs> you do not have time for that right now. Um, just keep these little pumpkins you got and keep it moving. I should have used the rest of them while I was in Michael's, though. I really do have to use it. And number one, just to be clear, because I feel like when you say use it, you're referring to number two most people like I got to pee but um so yeah I hate I got this hot ass jacket on with no shirt up under here the other day when we had to take the baby to urgent care I didn't have on my wig but I had a hoodie on with the hood tied up and by the time we was leaving it was so goddamn hot outside it kind of remind me of how are you trying to get over or I mean, I would have let you over, but no, my bad. 
But yeah, now today, I don't have on a shirt and it's hot as hell. But I'm about to go to Aldi. My mom reminded me that Aldi really is lit when it comes to meats. And Walmart has just been out of everything I need. And Food Depot be cool, but they price has been crazy too. So I just said, F it. I'm going to just go back to Aldi, get some more cases of water. And I'm going to look at their meats because we get like this big thing of ground beef. I think it's like $10 if that, or it might be like $10. And they got the breast, the breast. They got the best spring water. So I'm going to get, oh, they put a foot locker right here. Oh, where has this been right here? Okay. But yeah, then I gotta go to Family Dollar. I gotta find a Family Dollar to go to. And then I'll be home. It's almost one, but I'm so proud of myself, okay? She got up this morning. I washed clothes. Oh, it's a Food Depot right here. But I feel like it's kind of no point in going in there because they price is just crazy. But she got up this morning, washed clothes. Only got, I think, three more, two more loads of clothes, our clothes, then I gotta wash baby girl clothes. But I'm trying to wait until her other little outfits come so I could just wash all her stuff together. And I ordered just like some more onesies. I'm gonna show y'all when I get home. I just don't know. Cause like I said in my revamp video, my introduction video, I want to do more hauls. I wanna do Amazon hauls because unfortunately, I shop on Amazon more than I shop anywhere else. I will spend I'm not gonna even say how much, but I will spend a pretty penny in, on Amazon, but it's always a bunch of random stuff. So would y'all rather see like the random, just collective haul of stuff I have? Cause I rarely shop, uh, well, okay, like for instance, my baby shower, my baby shower was coming up. So of course, basically everything I bought was for my baby shower. But if I don't have like a specific event coming up, I'm, I'm just always shopping on Amazon. <laughs> I don't have anything else to say, but I'm just always on Amazon. Like, my boyfriend, we was watching some movie. I can't remember the name of it, y'all, but it was called, like, um, it was something about money um, and saving and stuff like that. And one lady was talking about how she spent, like, thousands of dollars a month on Amazon, I think. Now, of course your girl is not spending that much that's just ridiculous but i do spend a pretty good amount on amazon when it comes down to it so would y'all like for me to do just like a collective haul because like i just had hella packages over the last two days i have some coming today and some coming tomorrow so would y'all like me to just show y'all collectively what i get in a video or just like because what what if i don't have to vlog or i'm not necessarily vlogging anything interesting so would i just do a video or should i just put it wait and then put it in the vlog but then some of the stuff it's like i can't wait for i don't know i don't know i gotta figure it out One thirty-four, and we done okay we finally done y'all i just left family dollar and let me tell y'all the funniest thing was well, not really funny it's really annoying as hell but it was a black lady okay we had a black cashier a black lady was at the cashier's like register yeah cashier register y'all don't mind me i'll be um i forgot it's a donuts dollar general y'all don't mind me my mind just be gone so yeah but it was a lady at the register, a black lady. A non-pigmented lady was behind the black lady. Then there's me. And then, like I said, the black cashier. Y'all, the lady is putting her stuff up there. And the non-pigmented, um, non-melanated lady was on this lady's ass. So close. I'm looking like... And I didn't realize I was making a face because the cashier looked at me and she was like, she had no mask on, but I had a mask on. So the cashier was like, like, the, like, 
and then I saw the lady who was at the register, the black lady, she was looking at the cashier like, but she didn't see me because like I said, I was behind the non-pigmented lady. So the cashier was super nice to the black lady, but when the non-pigmented lady got up there, she ain't really have nothing to say. She ain't say nothing. <laughs> but that lady, like, if I could show y'all how that lady was on her ass, that was just ridiculous. And so I was telling the cashier, the nut pigment the lady wasn't even out the dough. And y'all know how family, like, them dollar stores be the dough be right there. She was like, girl, can you believe that shit? <laughs> she was like, her ass just all up on that lady. Like, damn, I was wondering if they was together. She was just talking shit, and the lady was still in there. That was so funny to me. And I was like, yeah, she's way better than me because I would have been like, can you back up? I've literally had to ask people to back up from behind me before. Like, and they be acting so offended or like confused, like back up. Like I had to ask this lady one time in ghetto ass Walmart. She was, I just felt her breathing down my neck. And I had a, sorry y'all hear all this noise. These niggas is racing, child. I'm gonna let them go ahead. Yeah, go ahead, honey. You don't even gotta ask me to get over. Just go on do it, cause y'all doing too much. But I will never forget this lady in Walmart was on my ass so bad. Y'all, I had a cart full of shit. Like we wasn't going nowhere no time soon with all the stuff that I had. And I don't know if she was like trying to rush me or what, but you know them non-pigmented don't be having no manners. So I told her, I was like, can you back up? And she was like, I beg your pardon. I was like, back up, back up. It's a pandemic going on. Like, back your ass up. And she was looking at me and she was just like, and I'm looking at her like, back up. Back up. Y'all remember Big Boy on ATL <laughs> when he was telling Antoine, he was like, back up. <laughs> That's literally like, back your behind up. Like, I just couldn't believe that. But, anywho. I don't talk y'all heads off. That's why I see with vlogging, child, I just be talking. I'm going to be honest. I'm a talker. But I'm finally on my way home. Thank you, Jesus. 2 o'clock. I left the house like around 10. I left the house like around 10. So like four hours to do what I had to do. That's not bad. But I am glad I called it and went ahead and went this morning. And did not wait until tomorrow because tomorrow like i said i have my doctor's appointment hey y'all so what's up it is the next day i was so tired last night that i did not finish vlogging child after i cooked that fish i was just done for it so i never did finish the vlog um i never wrapped it up i was just so drained y'all don't even understand so i just have it's chaotic i'm in the bathroom because my boyfriend in the other room watching TV, the baby chilling. So I said I'll just take this time to show y'all what I got from the beauty supply store and some of the stuff that I got from Amazon because maybe maybe I do have a, just a little slight problem because I ordered way more shit than I thought. But I'm gonna go through it. So I'm gonna show y'all what I got from the beauty supply store first. So as I was saying in the vlog that I have no brush and y'all see my hair is not all over the place today because your girl finally got three brushes i just got a little cheap pink dollar brush i think this one was two dollars and it's just like one of those soft grip oh you know what i probably need to take a picture of this sorry it's just one of those soft grip brushes and um i also just got like those little mini brushes that's like this but smaller but it's in my purse because i was running errors again today and I was like, I can't be out here lacking like that. So let me get, let me put another brush in there. And I normally keep one in my purse. I know I have one somewhere. I remember seeing one in my boyfriend's car after our baby shower. In our entire baby shower, I did not have a brush. I haven't had a brush for like four months. And I didn't to be spot, so I can't even tell you how many times. But I normally keep one. The problem is when I get like a protective style, I don't know what happens. I just lose it. So I got that. I got a big bottle of the Mane and Tail and Body. What? <laughs> Does this always say Body? Directions for human use. Directions for animal use. Has this always said this? Hold on. Not 
don't have no more shampoo, but I do have a little bit of conditioner. Is that what the tail is for? It's for actual animals? I never even peed. Oh my gosh. I'm really shocked. I'm blown moment. I never knew. I started using this back when I was in college and it works really, 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 really well for my natural hair. And I have 4C hair if you're new here. But all my OGs, if y'all remember, I used to do like those hauls. I used to go on my Rite Aid um, runs with my Tiger Bucks when I was in college because you could buy basically with your refund at the local Rite Aid and they used to do buy one, get one free. And it used to be like $2.99 for this. And somebody told me about this works good with natural hair. Maybe I was watching a YouTube video, but I've been using this for like at least six years along with my sister's natural um, shampoo. But I do like this one too. And this big one was only $8.99. The Holy Girl, everybody and their mama got edge brush. I like my edge brush now because it's a rat tail comb, but I just got this one because I don't like when the actual edge brush get gunky. I should've got two of those. I should've got two of these too because I think this is only $1.99 for four clips, soft touch clips. And I'm doing my hair. Definitely should've got more of these. I got two wig caps in the shade beige. I got a couple of cosmetic products. Which let me say the girl in um in Beauty Masters was so nice. Normally they be rude, but she was super nice. Um, but they got a thing now where when you're in the cosmetic part, you have to keep the cosmetics over there to check out because so many people be stealing. But I got a little pair of scissors. I always need these for lashes and things of such. I got two. LA Girl Pro Concealers, one in the shade Light Tan, and then Pure Beige, Odie's of Goody. I got two with one lip gloss and one lipstick. I'm almost certain I have this already, the LA Colors High Shine Shea Butter Gloss. I love this gloss, this lip gloss. In the shade Wink, yeah, I'm running out of Wink. So yeah, I really like this. And then I'm gonna try, I probably already have this too, but um the n a k the nick a k new york true matte lipstick in the shade santa fe sounds familiar maybe maybe not and then i just needed some some you know some regular glosses but i got one with glitter i hate our bathroom has this warm light i actually need to get my boyfriend to change this but yeah i got two. Oh yeah i need to get him to change this because i hate how yellow it is in here i can't do no content so yeah, I really need to buy them bolts actually and um, change those. I'll be doing that within the next two weeks. I would say week, but y'all take me, take us a little minute around here and now we got a baby child. But yeah, I just got two, you know, regular glosses. I think they were both 99 cent, but one has like little gold, rose gold flakes in it, which is really, really cute. Now, I'm going to show y'all the products I got from Amazon. I'm going to start with the hair products. Now, I don't have everything in here because, like I said, stuff has just been coming through. So, I'm going to show y'all the little stuff I got. I just got some more heat protector, which I use this heat protector plenty of times. It's also a hair polisher. I got this Kendra Volume Spray Super Hole 25. TikTok made me buy it. I got a... Baby hair flat iron, even though I'm not good with baby hairs, but I'm determined to learn all the girlies on TikTok and just hair girlies have these. So I decided to get them because I have been doing my own wig, even though it don't look like nothing in this video, baby, it looked good in a couple of my videos. Then I got this EBIN New York Wonder Lace Bond Adhesive Spray and I got the Extreme Firm Hold which I've been seeing a lot of the hair gurus talk about that. And it's supposed to be like better than got to be. And I honestly don't like got to be. For whatever reason, every time I bought the got to be spray, it sprayed like sporadic. It never just sprayed straight. So I don't really like got to be. I put on the screen what else I got. I got the EBIN New York Tenant Lace Spray. And basically, it's so you don't have to keep doing concealer on your lace. 
I think I got medium brown, but I should have got light brown. But light brown just looked way, way too light. I also got stuff for my baby, if y'all are interested. I got her a uh, baby lounger, a uh, personalized pacifier, and a little matching clip. We got some Alvino baby eczema therapy cream that we put on her every night, um, or therapy balm. And I got eight bottles in there, anti-colic bottles with lids, eight of them, four ounce for $23.90, which was a really good price. And I also got her baby milestone numbers because she turned one month last week and I want to take pictures and I still have not taken pictures, but that's okay, child. We're going to take them. Also, like I said, I got pregnancy band. I actually wore it today and yesterday when I got home. I just don't think I ever showed y'all. And oh, I also got this. I forgot. This is a hair product too. Finally, child. It's official, okay? I'm becoming a hair girly. We got the, this thing is heavy duty, child. Oh, goodness. We got the um, tripod stand for wigs. So I'm gonna put my wigs on there because how I got my wigs now, it's not really working. It's actually on my makeup stand and it's in the way. And I feel like I can never like get all the hair or whatever, so. I got that. I'm flip flopping. I'm supposed to do all the hair stuff first, but I forgot about that. So what else did I get? Oh, I got underwear, but y'all need to see underwear. I got an HDMI cord if anybody's interested. And then I showed y'all the drift little bundle that I got. And then I also got my baby some more footies. It's, it, it is getting colder, getting cool out. So I just got her some footies. Which they're cute. Just a little like donuts. Stuff like this. Super cute. I don't know if y'all can really see that. Boom, boom, boom. Uh, this one. This one she had on last night. Or the other day. But yeah. And everything will be listed below in my Amazon storefront. So I'm not going to list all these products individually. Maybe, maybe not. But the link for my Amazon storefront definitely will be below. I know the Amazon, not Amazon, but the UPS man told me he's never seen somebody return Amazon packages as much as me. The embarrassment, okay? But I got my baby two sets of Halloween pajamas. Like I said, that's why I was looking for those pumpkins because I'm gonna take her some cute little Halloween pictures. But she has this little onesie. It's so cute. Oh my gosh, y'all. This lighting is so yellow. I hope y'all can see. This was a terrible place to do a haul. My next haul definitely will be not be in here. But yeah. It's so cute. My little footy pajama. Chunk of my mom. And yay, her other onesie was in the bag. Or the next bag. But it's a cute little skeleton. So cute. Look at it. Oh my goodness. And then I got a little heart. A little orange heart right here y'all. So cute. And you put this one on like a regular onesie. And just button it. Oh this is so cute. And it come with a hat. You know what would have been cute? I thought for a second it was like a jack-o'-lantern. That would have been cute if they did that on the hat. But my baby always needs hats. I got some large cotton swabs because I use up like six or seven just to take my makeup off so I just wanted to get some large ones I'm sure I can get these in store somewhere but I just went ahead and ordered them this a little onesie and she got a little tutu skirt it's so cute oh my gosh oh this lighting is just terrible but she got a little skirt with it and some little leg warmers. And that would have been cute if they made these footies. But I got her Mickey Mouse theme. So that one. 
This one's so cute. I got a little glitter on it. What this one say? Heartbreaker. Oh, chunk of mamas. This one was my favorite for whatever reason. This one's so cute. No, I'm sorry. This one was my favorite, actually. This is what made me buy them. Child, finally. These is for me. This is for mama. I have been in need of more house shoes since I was pregnant. I had got some, but y'all, these big bazooka boat house shoes I got on because my feet was so swollen. I could not wear nothing but house shoes. So I finally ordered me some more. And it's so cute. I haven't had no pink house shoes in a minute. But I love me some like little. This has to be the mannequin head that goes on top of that. Which I'm sure. So it's the same price like if you were to get it from the beauty supply store. Because the beauty supply store sells this for $25 as well. I think the stand is $25 and the head is $25. I remember saying in Beauty Masters a long time ago and saying I was going to get one, but I never did. Oh, so, yeah. Finally got an official. Oh, girl. That go on here. It's lit. It's official. But, yeah, that's it for this haul. Again, I'm so sorry. It's so cheesy yellow in here. But I will talk to y'all in my next video. Thank y'all for tuning in.